Hey everyone, good evening, this is Raiko, today we're going to do another stream on Penny Star Online Episode 3, we're probably going to do them until we're done with the game, uh, without any uh, deviation to other games, but we'll see. So we've started the Ark story a couple days ago or so, we have already did the Hunter story uh, a few weeks ago. So this is the last story and then we'll go into the final boss, which is only unlocked after you finish both stories, pretty much. It's called the dark side there, but <laughs> it, it does look like they're evil if you, when you play the hunter story, but uh, when you actually play the, uh, on their side, you, you know that there's more to that. It's actually a bit deeper than that. I forgot to make some music there on the loading screen. Anyway. There was one last quest here, if I remember correctly, from yesterday, before we progress into the next year. But I'm kind of thinking that maybe I just want to create a deck for Endo, because I still didn't play with Endo at all. So maybe let's start the stream by creating a, a deck for Endo. Because I, I want to get... Uh, I want to get his ending at the very end. So I need to play most of the quests. I have to have more quests with him than with the other two main characters, Break and Lura. So as you see, he has high AP, 3 AP. He's buffed though. The the base game in the base game he only had 2 AP if I'm not mistaken. So in the plus version that we're playing, he has actually has 3 AP. This is also the official Sega buff. Uh, when the servers were up. When you went online, some cards got changed and this would be one of them. So it's not like the, the creator of the mod just decided to give to make him stronger, it's just officially Sega also thought that he should be stronger. So he has Rampage, but that's pretty much his thing, but Rampage against Hunters is very very strong. I guess he wouldn't be that strong when you fight against other arcs, but in this story, we're gonna only fight uh, hunters. Okay, let's go right into it. <clears throat> kind of want to have a guard creature theme because if I want to go around with him killing people, I need to actually be protected. Uh, I don't know if I have any good guard creatures at this point. I might not have... Well, there's one. Not sure it's a good one, but there, it's one. I can try maybe with the legacy thing. Would the leg legacy kill the, the, the creatures? Because if it kills the creatures, then I may actually get damaged back. Because a lot of guard creatures come with a disadvantage that when they die, you actually get damaged. There's one more. <clears throat> That's not... but uh, the blue one is a guard creature, unfortunately I don't have it. Ripple. Are you guard creature? Nope. I don't have many guard creatures yet, unfortunately. Hope I didn't miss any. Huh. Well, yeah, we don't... Oh, guard creature. What the hell is this? <laughs> what? HP change. By your own boss story character? What? Oh, is it, is it what they're called? Boss story character? What the hell? Uh, before each turn, if you have this card, changes to the number of cards on the field that you summon, including itself. Uh, it doesn't look very good. I don't understand. So it can have a maximum of. 4 HP, which is what it starts with anyway. 
This seems really, really bad. Extremely bad, actually. I, I don't know. I, I don't know. Anyway. Yeah, we gotta get more creatures, I guess. So I guess that that card creature strategy doesn't really hold much water. Uh, let me think. I guess we can keep those, though. It's fine. But we gotta have another theme to our deck. Let's just check the whole, the entirety of the cards. <clears throat> oh, we can try, start by checking that. Since they go to this card pile, it doesn't say that they're destroyed. Hmm. Do we, do, we do have native guard. I don't. I don't think I added this to the native deck that I have for break. Oh, weird. I should definitely do that. I don't know. I didn't. Maybe I. No, I, I had already had this before. Okay, let's just add the usual suspects for defense. <clears throat> All right, good enough for now. <clears throat> let's see. Action cards, I believe we're gonna focus on the physical ones. We're not gonna add any any text. We already have rampage. We're here are paying for a rampage when we already have it. Costs too much for what it does, I think. Why does it cost so much? Oh, it has heavy rampage. Eh, no, it's okay. It's it's not good on Endo. He already has rampage to begin with. Let's see. Oh, a double-edged, uh, what was that? The Russian, Russian Roulette. Yeah, I remember now. I think we're, keep, we're gonna keep away from it now. I also gotta calculate the probabilities of actually having a good outcome. Um... Dark attack and a beast attack. <coughs> I don't think we're gonna focus on any specific tribe right now because I am taking two uh, guard creatures of deep, two different tribes. So let's steer away from now. From now. Um, I guess these are not bad. Because, uh, yeah, on Endo, it's not that bad. Let's see, let's take at least two more. I really don't have that many yet. Hmm. I guess another slash. I guess we can take the round slash. No, that's kind of pointless against hunters for the most part. Oh, long arm. It's like deal 3 damage from afar. I don't think it's that good though. Damn, that, that's a muscled Dull Saber. <laughs> Looks quite strong. Um, 
I guess I had one more of those, and that's gonna be it for now. Now about the, the actual creatures. I don't know. Um, Honestly, do not know. I think I really need that uh, those guard creatures it's because without those, I'm not sure what to pick. Morphos was super buffed. I think he had like two AP or something. I think he was really super buffed. I don't know, man. What do I take? HP Halver. I thought he said more HP, he only says 6. What? Okay, well. Hey, it's not much. I thought he said like 10 or, or more. Damn. Um, I don't know. We go with wolves. Hmm, <coughs> no. Huh. I really need more creatures, <laughs> even though I have a lot of them already. I do feel like I really need a few more. Double S rank. <laughs> 13 AP, god damn it. I'm, I really don't know what to take. Uh, let's add a couple more defense cards. Because I'm not going to be adding uh, 10 more creatures, I don't think. Oh wait, I, I will add six cards though, let's see. I mean, I'll be here forever. <laughs> Oh, it, it lasts forever, the, the effect of the rich cards. Should I try the legacy thing? It's not as good as, as I thought though, because that card creature doesn't really survive for long. Let's try it anyway. Let's take a couple of big creatures and then try to use a legacy on to, to summon one of them. The other ones should be small though, or on the small side of things. I wish there was some card that would synergize with several tribes. Like currently I'm playing uh, Hearthstone and there's some cards that actually benefit you if you play with different tribes. In this case it would be with Max, uh, Abyss and Native, but I don't think there's anything like that here. Gar's Demolisher.
I cost Slayer. IP4 is quite a lot, let's put one of those. <clears throat> this is a Bartle do, it's a major slayer. Oh, it's actually quite strong. Eh, sorta. So we have one, two native, two ABs, I guess let's put two, two max. I kinda want stuff to use uh, attack cards though. Attack uh, action cards. Limited action. I don't think there's any max. Wait. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> hmm. Yeah, the max don't seem very good here. Couple claws. I guess we can put that thing. This has zero EP, so it relies on having. A <laughs> it relies on the action cards. <clears throat> but it does hit multiple enemies, so. That's. Uh, yeah. Hmm. Carnage speed up. Oh, okay. Heavy rampage. Okay, this relies on using uh, action cards because of the artifice. Immobile. Okay. I can put one of those. <clears throat> okay, one more. I have a lot of uh, creature cards, but when you look at it, I don't actually have many of each tribe. I don't think it makes sense to take Morphus. Haste. Oh right, Darkbringer. I guess let's put a Hilda Bear and be done with it. Or random AP attack is here enable. I actually like this one this one. Let's put that one. Wait. Let's put the bear. I feel like this deck is not very good, but we're gonna try it out and we'll we'll see. Double check, there's no quests to accept here. Okay. And let's get right on to it. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, it was about Romeo trying to find the lost Rappy. Pet Rappy Kate. 
Okay. Oh, min and max roll. <laughs> okay, this is not. This is not gonna go well with this car with this deck. I'm gonna try anyway. Kilria. Should I? No, let, let's go for it. <clears throat> but it's definitely not a good good for this deck because I can't even roll a six or a five to equip the highest uh, cost ones. But maybe legacy. I don't know if Legacy will help much here. Because Legacy itself costs two action points. To use, so. Yeah, we'll see. <coughs> no, I'm looking for Rappy Kate. <laughs> I wish you actually communicated with each other so that I would. Be, that you'd be able not to fight randomly. Okay, I actually got uh, three cost ones, so I'm gonna keep. I also have the claws that just cost one, but can't stick with that one. I actually want to go there on myself and try to hit her with the endo, so don't want this thing to be in front of me. Uh. Why is it like chaos from Sonic Adventure? Is it because it's the the plus version? I've never actually summoned the plus cards, so I don't know if it's a thing about these cards. She's not gonna use decks, I'm pretty sure. So move patient. Patience and keep those. Oh, we got Legacy already. <laughs> uh, I won't be able to summon Ilgil though. So Legacy costs two. Usually it's tough rounds down in this game, so half of the three points that that thing costs is just one, so it's actually net negative. <laughs> I need to have more stuff on the field. Kind of questioning if this is that good. Half the sum of these card characters action points. So if I have eight worth, which is the maximum, I get four. But if I'm using two, I get four. It means I only get two. I basically only get plus two. <laughs> That's not very good. Hmm. Well, what can you do? That thing will do no damage. That's fine. <coughs> so this will be better when I get those cards that, that add a lot of... Uh, the action cards that add a lot of attack damage. Yeah, I don't think Legacy is going to be very useful in, in this fight. Or maybe ever for me with this deck, so we'll see. Uh, we got counter. Seventy percent chance. That's not a bad chance. No, oh, she's moving. She's just running away. Okay. <coughs> Oh man, what what a bad roll. Thank <laughs> you. 
I can actually chain a lot of cards here. Suppress gun. I cannot really show the Rampage ability if she doesn't equip more than one item at the same time. Able to, we won't be able to destroy that weapon here, so I'm just gonna summon a, a creature. <coughs> Suppressed is plus two. I guess I'll leave the heavy blow there so I can uh, AP silence. Okay, claw also helps. So if I roll a 4 and use Legacy, I can actually equip uh, all the other cards. All the, the bigger cards. So maybe I may be able to actually do it. I don't know why the 6 even appears there, since it can never actually land. I'll just do that to guarantee killing the shield. Defense. And you'll see here that I attack all. Uh... Wait, I didn't even kill the shield. Oops. Wait, but why not? No, I did. I did. Okay, so that damage was only for the gun. The shield gets more damage because of the action card. <laughs> Complicated game. I guess let's just throw that out. Okay, we got the, the Albiter. Um, I guess we'll let's wait for a legacy and for the other claw as well. And then we'll have the combo. <laughs> Maybe I should use a assist car that gives me a, a full hand. That should make it survive. I guess I should always give this to Endu. The action cards because uh, he attacks all uh, all weapons. She might be dead actually, right? Oh no, she'll be left with an HP. Oh wait, what? Oh, she still had the, the shield. My bad. Well, this is seven points. Never mind that one. That one is impossible in the <laughs> with the max roll of four. Well, I guess now it's possible with the extra dice roll, but. Eh. 
Well, she didn't equip anything. I guess it's over next turn, huh? I could summon another one, but it doesn't really matter. <laughs> oh, she actually defended. I don't think she defended earlier, or did she? Anyway, she's dead anyway. All right, GG, easy. B plus. Angel Harp. I haven't seen that either in episode 3 or any of the other PSO games. I don't know what that is, the, the, the Angel Harp. Assist Trash. <laughs> I'm guessing it just removes. Uh, oh, another legacy. It just removes uh, Assist cards from the field. Ass Trash. <laughs> it moves all Assist cards from the hand to this card pile. Wait, from the hand? Oh! I guess you can disrupt combos using this from the opponent. Wait, it's self? Wait, what? I don't understand what this is supposed to do. From the hand of this card pile, why would you even want to do that? I don't understand at all. You can just discard them at the end of your turn anyway, if you wanted. Does that mean that... Is there any card that uh, benefits from you having no hands? When, like, during the attack phase? I don't know, I'm completely clueless there. Okay, the... Skip act. The act phase of this team will be skipped while this card is on the field. Well, it affects everyone. The effect begins two turns after the set phase of the setting this card. Oh. I guess it's for a bit of stall, but seems a bit pointless. Especially costing three points. Three action points. Alright, and then we got the Angel Harp, the Hunter's item. Kate's back! <laughs> oh, so you just rescued Kate so that we bring her back to the forest? Okay. <laughs> she sounds different. I guess all rapids look the same. Okay, let's see what we have next. <coughs> emergency. D did she say emergency? Oh. Why would the government have computers on Raggle? Why can't they just have them on Pioneer 2 where they're safe? <laughs> oh well. Unseen enemy 1. Oh, you sent them to.
Okay, let's talk with everyone and then do one more quest. Today will be a bit of a shorter one. <coughs> and Luda is always here. Sure, we'll do. Yeah, Break looks sad, I'm guessing, be after his meeting with uh, Silver. Or maybe after the meeting with Kranz and in all this, then. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Thanks for sharing. She's actually so positive. I feel like she may have a mission for me. <coughs> mm, oh, it's really about silver. So he really is uh, disturbed with that. When you played the Hunter's story, it seemed like you'd be a bit more indifferent at first, but he really is disturbed from the very start. Is that woman Silver or the or her sister? I'm actually not quite sure. <laughs> That's uh, quite the, the dialogue lines. I talk to myself a lot, don't worry about it. If you don't want to hear me, then don't stand so close to me. It's not like I want you listening in on me. Fair enough. Hey, Memoru. Ooh. Okay, that's quite the start. Oh, but we're gonna get the card reward, I think. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> reward? Question mark? Why would Viviana have a monster card? I don't think that's gonna happen. Or a creature card, I should say. My, how aggressive. Let's see if we have any uh, side quests here. We probably will have at least one. A man named Dent. Lazy bum. Uh, yes, I know you know this. <laughs> She's a member of the Hunters, I guess. It looks like she's got a fan club of her own. Oh, that's where this job comes from, you see. This fan club wants you to tell her how much they love and admire her. Okay, whoa. In all these rocks. I agree, I agree. Just generic dialogue. Okay. So I actually have three quests here. Let's see which one I will pick real quickly. <clears throat> I 
I guess in all these rocks or lazy bum, both of them will not advance the the, the story. But Endo is already in the this past, I think, deployed whatever. Now it's fan club. Official and unofficial in all his fan club. <laughs> We'd like to respect the request that you convey to Miss Enol is our utmost passion and admiration for her existence. Wow. I mean, we're gonna beat on her if, if I accept that quest, so that's kind of an odd thing. Dent. I guess let's just convey Inalis' uh, fans' love to her. But. Oh, she's actually. I can actually pick him here, but. Let me just double check that Endu is actually on the. Dispatched on the story quest. <clears throat> yeah, he is, but I guess I can still pick him, whatever. Um, let me just double check that there isn't any cutscene here. Where was that again? I guess for the arcs, there's only cutscenes involving Break, Endu, and Lura. To the three main characters. In the Hunters, there was actually also for uh, Kilria, even though she was not one of the three main characters. Alright. Let's pick the, the Weirdo again. Maybe we can uh, show legacy working now. <laughs> I'm already thinking about which three new cards we're gonna get. Kinda anxious to get those uh, like cards that benefit when you select all native or all a beast and so on. What is a passion? What? <laughs> I definitely need more more cards to unlock and the full potential though. I hope I can do it uh, soon. Like good guard creatures is a good start. This thing has a ton of uh, range, I don't need to put it ahead. Fine, I don't think she's gonna attack me on the on her first turn. <laughs> she did the roll of six though. <laughs> oh man, now she just goes forward and uses a technique. Okay, maybe not enough points anymore for that. Oh, right on my face. Um, I kind of want to summon stuff, so I guess let's do that. Defense. <laughs> Rampage can be so strong. 
All items destroyed. And two health lost. Okay, here I may actually look for better one than dodge. Change. There's patience. Technique. Defense. Nope. Change dice. Set. Okay, so I have uh, three points plus two, five, six, seven, eight with this one. So it will be a full house. So if I get the legacy in a strong monster, I can actually just transition to that. Alright, no one moves, no need Action. for that. I'm just gonna <laughs> keep attacking with the uh, with Endu really. With Bartol? Oh, AP silence. I was like wondering why Bartle has zero AP. Okay, okay, gotcha. Defense. It's gonna be done in no time. <laughs> Every attack, I remove all her weapons. Well, all her equipment, generally speaking. There's actually an action card that also makes. Um, Creatures have rampage, but I haven't gotten it yet. Uh, I think I'll keep patience. Okay, we got legacy and we got the monkey. That's not good enough. I need one of those three big cards. <coughs> I'm kind of discovering as I go here. I'm I don't. I never really even owned Legacy before. <coughs> what was that? Whatever it was, it didn't. It didn't connect. Mobile. Okay. Uh, unfortunately, I don't really have <laughs> anything to put. If I used Legacy. Okay, let's see. Well, not much to, to say here. Just got to keep doing what I'm doing. Yeah, let's do that. I should attack first with uh, zero damage to lure out any any defense cards. But anyway, she doesn't have any, so she's basically dead already. Rip. He got his AP back. I actually didn't notice uh, if he did or not. If he didn't, uh, I guess she would still be dead, because this one would kill her. Alright. Well, not kill her, but you know, make defeat her, make her faint, whatever. A rank, nice! Haven't got one of those in a while, I think. Or maybe I did. Okay, now on to the card rewards. It's been a while since I leveled up. <laughs> they took five minutes only. Leafy. Bequeath, I had that one on my main save. Govomer, same. They're kinda common. Bulk, I also had this one. But it's a bit more rare. And that will be all, I guess. So basically makes the creature that dies, you get XP. You go to the max... Max HP. So if, the, if it's actually a strong character, 
You're gonna get a ton of XP. AP silence. Hmm. It's alright. It's better when when I have the the cards that boost uh, A beasts. This one I don't like it too much. It's only with a 30% chance. <laughs> what? You fought her? Who asked you to do that? <laughs> what were you thinking? <laughs> You'd better watch your back for a while, Buster. Walks president president in all his fan club. Yeah, I mean, yeah. <laughs> It's quite the development. <clears throat> anyway, before I forget, I mentioned earlier that I wanted to add some cards to break stack. I, I forgot to actually do it. Uh. It was uh, since this only has a beast. No, actually, has a lot of stuff. Okay, never mind. Only when they have a beast, I or sorry, when they have native, I will use the the action cards that focus on those specific types, such as uh, like you know native cards, for example. But I'll need to focus on one of them, and I don't think I have any deck right now that focuses. For some reason, I thought to break was focusing on them. I may be confusing with the, uh, the CPU deck, because the CPU deck had break focusing on those. Anyway. That was kind of quick, but I think I'll still stop regardless. Uh, it's kind of late. I started kind of late today. And tomorrow's a big day, I gotta get up early and whatnot, so... Yeah, that'll be it for today. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.